गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू ऑनलाइन क्लासेस वी हैड बीन रीडिंग द चैप्टर यूनिट फोर सेक्शन बी द लामा इन दिस चैप्टर दिस चैप्टर हैज बीन टेकन फ्रॉम अ बिग फ्रॉम द बुक रिटन बाय दीपा अग्रवाल एंड द बुक इज कॉल्ड कैरवन टू टिबद इन दिस वी कम टू नो अबाउट द मोनेस्ट्री द मॉन्स द लाइफ ऑफ मॉन्स हाउ डू द लिव what is buddhism uh, how do they pray to buddha so what is uh, what does a monastery look like from inside so all these things we come to know in this chapter so till now we have read the story that there are uh, many characters first one is debu he has come to tibet and to visit the monastery the famous monastery of tibet and he has come there with uh, to visit the monastery also and also to find some answers to his question about his father he wanted to ask when he uh, when he goes and uh, pay his respect in front of the lama who is uh, a boy uh, he he is about to ask questions about his father but he doesn't ask because he does not want to create an awkward situation for everyone for those by asking those questions for whom for which uh, there might not be any real answer so uh they were in the they all the group there there is kalyan singh there is sonam darka there is uh um, hayat and uh, sonu also all all of them are in a group they all have gone to visit the monastery and they all are in a group and they have they have come to visit the monastery kalyan singh is the is their leader he is is the one who is showing them around in the monastery he knows about uh, the monks and the life of the mon- monks and the monastery a lot so uh, the the head monk also the lama also uh, asked him about uh, the well being in his country and uh, uh, about the ruler of the country that is the prime minister of the country so uh, when they came out of the monastery all the group uh, trilok singh one of the character in their group one of the person in their group he uh, he seem seems unhappy with debu and he seems very anxious and uh, he is not uh, he is a very mean and selfish kind of person and he is keeping a secret eye on debu also so uh, kalyan singh tries to make him understand that do not dis, uh, do not don't be re- disrespectful towards the lamas because uh, we honor them we worship the buddha and it is due to their blessings that we are we are being rewarded now let's read on yes yes jeevan added now there is another character jeevan you will bring bad luck to us with this behavior because uh, trilok singh was uh, behaving very badly with the rest of the group and he was being disrespectful towards the lama also so that's why jeevan also said says that you will bring bad luck to us with with your b- uh, wrong behavior i will say what i want trilok said defiantly and stomped off defiantly means uh with the, without uh, agreeing to the point now matlab ziddi zid mein aake uh in aggression he says and he then went from there that i'll do whatever i'll say whatever i want the other gazed after him anxious frowns wrinkling their brows so they all were frowning at him they did not like him they did not like his comments they did not like his behavior they were very angry with him they be found it hard to sleep that night questions crowded his mind they would be in gatok soon suppose he could not trace his father no no he squashed down the thought 
I definitely will. The money bag felt like a lump of iron digging into his belly. As he tossed and turned, it felt so uncomfortable that he decided to untie it and place it under the rolled up old shawl that was his pillow. Now, when now they have come back to their hotel rooms and uh, now that night debu found it very hard to sleep because there were so many questions in his mind and soon they would be in gatok in another city away from, uh, in tibet only and suppose he he could not trace his father what if he could not trace his he had come to tibet to search his father no no he squashed down the thought squashed means leave immediately put the thought out of his mind वहीं पे दबा दिया दफ्न कर दिया उसको वापस वो रॉन्ग जो थॉट था नेगेटिव थॉट था वहीं का वहीं उसने खत्म कर दिया ट्राई टू डू दैट आई डेफिनेटली विल देन वेरी ऑप्टिमिस्टली पॉजिटिवली ही मेड हिज थॉट पॉजिटिव दैट आई विल बी एबल टू सर्च माय फादर फाइंड माय फादर द मनी बैग द ही वॉज कैरिंग अ बैग फुल ऑफ मनी फेल्ट एंड ही वॉज ही हैड टाइड दैट मनी बैग विद हिज with his belly belly means uh, stomach so he was sleeping with that uh, money bag tied to his stomach around his stomach but it was uh, just digging him in his belly he uh, it was pinching him so he tossed and turned curvety leta ra tossed and turned means kept on changing sides it felt so uncomfortable that he decided to untie and finally when he was it was it became unbearable for him to sleep at all so he decided to untie the money bag and place it under the rolled up old shawl that was his pillow so he had a, he did not have a real pillow he had made he had rolled up a shawl to to act as a to use it as a pillow so he decided to untie that money bag and keep it in that shawl perhaps the some restlessness made him come awake in the middle of the night no it was something pressing on his chest almost suffocating him suffocating him means making him difficult to breathe terrifying thought a terrible thought terrifying means a very horrible thought course to his course through his mind course to him came to his mind was it a robber was he being robbed of his money that a thief has come a robber has come and robbing robbing of uh, his money he could hear a jagged repetitive sound jagged means um Uh, sharp rough sharp points protruding hair heavy repetitive sound someone breathing heavily close by now he could hear as he try to uh, collect his thought that what was happening because since when you are in sleep you are uh, it 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 is said that you are half dead whenever you are in deep sleep it is said that you are half dead so when uh, he woke up he woke up ab- abruptly all of a sudden he could not uh, collect his thought that where he was what what was happening to him somebody was suffocating him somebody was choking him somebody was trying to uh, uh, just uh, kill him or uh, stop his breathing right so he could uh, hear a jagged repetitive sound someone breathing heavily close by but he had heard that robbers never came silently so now he could hear when uh, uh, he, he his mind became a little alert he could hear somebody's breathing heavy breathing uh, in his room in his tent um, but he had heard that robbers never come silently uh they let out fierce cries or uh, to terrorize their prey prey means their victim so robbers never come silent never came silent they 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 make out a very shrilling very fierce strong and terrifying cries to make their victim 
terrorize to terrorize their victim and fired their guns and they had guns and they kept on firing from those guns could it be a wild animal then then he thought that could it be a wild animal who was attacking me should he cry out for help now he should uh, should he uh, cry out for some help he was about to scream scream means shout when he felt hands moved down his chest towards his waist and recognized that nauseous smell nauseous means um, uh, which makes you feel vomited quick as a flash flash means lightning debu reached out and grabbed gap means held the searching hands he heard a strangled exclamation strangled means squeezed constricted restricted exclamation exclamation means sound hands fought frantically to free themselves frantically means very violently those uh, whoever was had attacked him debu had caught his hands and he tried hard he he fought hard to free his hands debu struggled to hold on but debu also fought to keep his hold on those hands but the hands were fiendishly strong fiendishly means extremely cruel cruelly strong sluggish sluggish means slow inactive with sleep the debu could not grip them grip means hold them enough and they wrenched wrenched themselves out of grass wrench means khinch ke le jana pulled them themselves out of the grass grass means grip hold from hold of debu ki debu ke haath se wo khinch ke usne apne haath chudaye aur wo he ran away with the muffled cry muffled means w e uh, suppressed cry he sat up he means debu sat up and flung off his bed clothes flung off means threw someone was stumbling away stumbling means running away he was about to cry out give chase cry out means shout and give chase chase means run after him but something stopped him it would lead to more quarrels could even delay their departure debu lay down again thanked providence providence means god for the impulse that made him remove the money bag the impulse the idea the thought which made him remove the money bag he would have to be very careful now so who who is that who was that person who had attacked me attacked him it was it was trilok singh who had attacked him because he was eyeing him he was staring at him he was keeping an eye on him and he wanted his money bag his bag full of money so that's all in this video that's here we finish our chapter the reading of our chapter and the explanation of our chapter i hope children you have understood the chapter if you have any difficulty please message me okay have a nice day thank you very much